Hey guys, tonight me and Tammy are going to be trying this Devour Pizza. This one is the ultimate sausage and peppers. And it is sweet Italian sausage, fire roasted bell peppers, caramelized onions, love those, smoked provolone, gooey mozzarella cheese, and savory tomato sauce on a crispy thick crust. Um, that's what it looks like. 26 ounces, one pound, 10, 10 ounces is what it weighs. Um, one fifth of the pizza is 350 calories if you, if you slice it into five pieces. So basically you're going to preheat your oven to 400 degrees, place the unwrapped frozen pizza on a baking sheet in the, in the middle rack of the oven, bake for 29 minutes, flat out, they don't even give you a range, 29 minutes until the edge is golden brown and then cool slowly and that's what it's supposed to look like. So I've got the, um, I've got a baking sheet and I just put parchment paper on it just so um, it's easier to clean up honestly because I'm lazy, um, so the cheese won't stick on the pan. It makes no difference, it still toasts up just fine. So this is it. Um, we bought these at Meyer. Um, they have them other places too. We saw them recently um, at Kroger, I believe, but um, I don't pay attention to how much they were. But they were at Meyer for four fifty, so um, they were on sale though. So I don't, but I don't know how much they were at Kroger. I didn't, I truly didn't even look. So there's what it looks like: plenty of onions and peppers on there, and sausage. So I'm gonna get this in the oven and set the timer, and I'll be back. Okay, this is what it looks like when it comes out of the oven. I'm gonna scoop it up and put it on my little cardboard thing because I like to use this stuff to, to cut. All food should be mouth-watering, period. End of story. So in each of our meals, we dollop the taste, max out the flavor, turn up the texture, tender meats and creamy sauces, crispy crusts and gooey cheeses, spicy, smoky, or savory, sometimes sweet, always ridiculously good. So this one is Italian sausage, bell peppers, onions, provolone, mozzarella, and tomato sauce. Right. Um, the tomato sauce, they show it um, like a, lot more, a lot more on the box yeah. uh, because when when Kevin took it out of the wrapping and had it before it went into the oven, I told him, I said, you really don't see the red sauce mm. at all. You still don't see it even. Uh, while I'm no. Even. So it's a, it, I think it's a very thin layer. Yeah. It's not, it's not very uh, thick sauce. No. And uh, just in case you want to know, I've done on the Lunchtime Review channel, my other channel, um, I've done a bunch of Devour meals. Devour makes regular like frozen dinners and uh, I've done a bunch of them. Sandwiches and, and actually meals and stuff and they've all been really good. So if you're interested you can go watch those. Yeah you did like big thick sandwiches. Mm -hmm, like grilled cheeses. Or... Yeah. Well they were called like like um, either Link Cuisine or Weight Washers one half, and they were they called them like paninis. That's kind of what the devour yeah, looks like. Them. It's yeah. like a panini, and it's the big thick bread, and, and and they come flat, and then you would put them together. Is but that I, how those were? Yeah, but I don't. I never put them together. I always ate them as flat face. Oh, because really? yeah. they're easier. Yeah. Because sometimes they can be hard to bite into. I like flavor. I like the peppers and I like the onions. The peppers are a little, a little mushy, mm -hmm. but um, but not bad. They're not super watery like you sometimes get on pizzas. The sausage has a good flavor. Mm -hmm. Not overly spiced. It's just a nice sausage. Um, we've tried like three of these now. This is our fourth one. You always, your the crust is always what's the falling factor for you. What do you think? What well, has same the crust. same crust? <laughs> <laughs> After eating four of these. Yeah, it does have the same price. If you've watched all of these reviews, it's the same crust. So, I really am hoping that they will come out with a thinner one um, that's not so doughy. And when they do that, I hope they add, um, they put some more toppings on there. Like, um, I like the flavor of this one. I, I do. I, you can really taste the bell pepper and onion, uh, the sausage. I really like the flavor of the sausage, but it needs more. Mm -hmm. It really does need more. Um, it does. I agree with you. I mean, I'm not nitpicking. It, no, it it's really, very sparse. They, yeah, it's sparse. And, and, and one of the things that they say on the front is they talk about that tomato sauce. Honestly, I don't taste the tomato no, sauce not at all. all. 
No. Um, you I'm get more peppers, onions, and a little bit of the sausage every once in a while. Yeah, and the cheese, you uh, the cheese is um, it's good. It's, it's good. good. It's not a strong cheese. No, it's not. But it, but um, I'm sure it helps to hold everything else yeah, on there. Yeah, that's really. Um, good. And I'm wondering if that does, it doesn't um, isn't why they use the uh, tomato sauce is to help hold some stuff on there. Yeah. I don't know because there's just not much on there to make a difference with the flavor. Yeah. Well, I noticed like mine, the two pieces I have left have quite a bit of sausage on it. You got one that's got some sausage on it, the other one has hardly any at all. Right. And the one I ate had hardly any at right. all. Right. So, but yeah. the sausage is good. It's not a, it does have some uh, spice to it, not hot spice. Like seasoning. Just, just, just seasoning, yeah. yes. Um, so it's not just like a regular sausage, but it's not hot either. Right. So if you like a seasoned sausage, um, yeah, then I think good. you would like this. I think it's worth trying, especially if you can get them on sale for four fifty. Give it a shot. Yes. Pick the one you like the best and just try it out. I think they're worth trying, and then you can just judge on yourself. Because I like them. Not my favorite pizza, but but definitely a good pizza. Right. This yes, exactly. This will not take the place of of our favorite pizza, but uh, for four fifty, if you, if you are comfortable with spending 450 and you aren't comfortable with spending more for your That's favorite seven, pizza yeah, yeah then you could buy these yeah I, I personally will stick with my favorite um but uh it's a good price for what you get yeah. so i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching